tell the truth. Did you get much work done today at the office? Mm -hmm. Or were you like everybody else, busy <laughs> watching basketball or sneaking around trying to watch it? March Madness is officially underway today. It is, and Tim <laughs> is here now. He's following all of it for us, and we're already having excitement here. There is absolutely, absolutely no question about it. March Madness has become March Sadness for some of the teams uh. already. How about ninth-ranked Iowa State, the number three seed? They were upset by UAB, a 14 seed. Mm -hmm. Then Georgia State beat Baylor with a three ball, center pocket, and a closing seconds. And here we go. Bracket busters in the afternoon. Meanwhile, the Maryland Terrapins had their little shoot around, and Terrapins getting loose. The warm up session for tomorrow night's game with Valparaiso. The Terps are favored, but Valpo is an upset special in a lot of the fans' brackets. Robert Burton is in Columbus with the Terrapins. RB, what are they saying? Well, Tim, I think you know as being a Maryland Terp, former Maryland Terp, that is what they have to offer in the postseason. Back in the early 2000s, two back-to-back -back Final Four appearances. Well, this is just step one of getting Maryland back to where they used to be. It's been a slow crawl for the Terps getting back to the big dance. It's been a while, but I think that we're ready for it. Last NCAA tourney for the Terps back in 2010. Well, they're here now, and they'll take a shot at going all the way. Are you prepared to fly back if they lose? Oh, no way. We're not going to lose, so there's no need to fly back. Do you have any advice for the Terps? Shoot it. <laughs> I guess not. Hey, Coach Mark Turgeon was hoping to go dancing way before now when he took the job back in 2011. I got an ego. So, yeah, maybe it did take a little bit longer than I anticipated. Because um, I think we're going to win every game, and obviously we haven't. But I'm really proud of what we've done at Maryland. But players say all that matters is now. Finally getting to play here and with these guys, I wouldn't want to be here with any other team. It's amazing. And coming up in sports at 5 o'clock, we'll talk about Valpo. They're not your average mid-major team. You want to watch out for them, especially in March. Tim.